So I'll be showing how to convert a PDF into a Word document and then use also Translate or Immersive Reader on it. So here's a PDF I already have open in the browser and it's a nice long PDF with lots of text and images. And I'm just going to save that to my desktop. So I'll hit save. Now I've switched to Word and I'm going to open that PDF I just saved. So I'm going to go to File, Open and choose the PDF. Now Word is going to convert that PDF and open it right in Word. Now you can see the full PDF is opened in Word, but it's still a PDF file you can see up here. So first we have to actually save it as a Word document. So I'll hit File, Save As, and I'm going to save this as a Word document to my desktop. So now you can see up at the top it's labeled a docx, so now it's a Word file. Now I can do a couple different things with this document. First off, I can run the Immersive Reader. So if I go to the View tab and click Immersive Reader in Word, you can see I can do things like change the background color, I can make it narrower, I can increase the text spacing, break the words into syllables, and if I scroll down, you can see some of the text here. I can make the text bigger, and I can do line focus, and then I can do read aloud. RTI International is an independent. So I can do immersive reader on a PDF. The other thing I can do is I can upload this document to the web and then I can use all the full functions of immersive reader. This is in Word Desktop. So I'm going to close this. The other thing I can do with my PDF and think about non-native speakers but also think about the parents of non-native speakers is I can translate this entire document in just a couple of clicks. So if I go to the review tab, I click on translate and I choose Translate Document. And I have many choices to choose from. I can translate this in over 65 languages. And let's say I'm going to choose to translate to Spanish and I click the Translate button. Now it's going to make a whole new document in Spanish. So now the entire document is in Spanish and everything is accessible in that new language. And I could even upload this document into Office.com, open it up in Word for the web, and with our web technologies we can do read aloud in real time. If you want to do the immersive reader in Spanish, you'll have to download to the desktop version of Word that Spanish voice. But if you put it into the office.com Word web, it'll access that read aloud voice right away. So two really nice and quick tips to make Word more accessible and inclusive when working with PDFs.